When we talk about hubs of technological innovation, we tend to talk about coastal cities, not Midwest farming communities. So it might come as a surprise to some that the future of energy independence was not built with silicon, but with repurposed steel in the center of the country. In 1987, the Bruyne family traveled from their family farm in Minnesota to Scotland, South Dakota, to buy parts from an auction at a shuttered ethanol plant. But the price was too good to pass up, so they purchased the entire plant. This unassuming facility would become the first Poet biorefinery and a testing ground for many of the company's biggest innovations. Soon after taking on the role of managing the Scotland facility and making it operational, it became clear to Poet founder Jeff Bruyne that it had the potential to be more than just an ethanol plant. He realized it could be the home base to launch an energy revolution. And so, over the years, the Scotland plant shifted its focus almost entirely to research and development. It is now known as the Poet Research Center. The Scotland plant has been instrumental, not only launching the technology that became all the poet plants you see out there today, but still today is extremely important in driving everything we discover in our lab to a commercial scale. Poet's advanced research facilities provide poet engineers and researchers a rare opportunity to see their work move from lab scale to pilot scale and on to commercial use. The spirit of innovation has manifested itself into a company-wide culture that impacts all departments and the work they do. Poet's patented no-cook BPX biorefining process not only results in energy-efficient biofuel production, but gives way to more unexpected solutions, like Jive, an eco-friendly asphalt rejuvenator that heals aging roads across the country without harmful petroleum-based chemicals. When the world was faced with a COVID-19 crisis in early 2020, Poet's imaginative and nimble approach allowed the company to quickly pivot production to address yet another urgent global need by mass-producing all-natural, high-quality sanitizer in plants across the Midwest. While the company's reach is now global, Poet's commitment to efficiency and renewable energy begins at the source by powering their plants with waste wood, landfill gas, and steam turbine technology, and by utilizing a hyper-efficient total water recovery process. These clean energy solutions are the result of a philosophy and work ethic that prizes efficiency and innovation. And for every world-changing idea or technology Poet has already introduced, there are countless more in development. Poet's beginnings were humble, rooted in building a sustainable future for the Bruyne family, their community of farmers, and the land they lived on. Today, Poet is a global presence, with thousands of employees working to solve the climate crisis with clean-burning biofuels, renewable bioproducts, and a host of other intelligent and practical tools they've enhanced over three decades. Just like the Bruyne family saw an unlikely opportunity in that abandoned ethanol plant so many years ago, when the innovators at Poet look ahead today, they continue to envision more and more opportunities to create a brighter, more sustainable future for us all.